Hey guys, got somewhat of a different uh, type of rifle out on the bench today. Looking at a, a Mossberg Plingster. And big question is, are they any good? Well, I have to say, this rifle here was purchased for under $100 brand new. And in my book, anytime you can get a usable rifle for less than 100 bucks and it functions, that's a heck of a deal. Uh, I think this would serve you know, quite a few different uses. Uh, one being maybe a truck gun, throw it behind your seat. If it gets beat up, tore up, you know, you're not out much. Second would be a, like a woods gun. It's extremely lightweight, really lightweight. Um, this, this model here is the 715T. Uh, it uses the same action as all the other uh, 702 Plinksters, I believe it is. The, uh, this one come from the factory with a threaded muzzle and the big long 25 round magazine. Now I will say, the 25 round magazine, the tactical magazine that it comes with is absolutely junk. This rifle would not feed. You would get through maybe four or five rounds, it would jam every time. I went back and uh, just picked up a couple of just regular 10 round Plinkster mags. You used to be able to get these at Walmart, most gun shop sells them. You can even get them off eBay. They're relatively inexpensive and since I've did that, it has ran 100%. I hear a lot of guys bad mouth these little rifles. They they don't get the uh, the uh, kudos that they deserve in my book. They're uh, fairly accurate. I'm going to shoot a few rounds here and we'll go down and look at a target at about 55 yards and let you guys see the accuracy of it. I just got a cheap six power scope on it. I leave this one in the shed. Um, it's just a it's just a fun little rifle. Really inexpensive and, and easy to shoot, but uh, we'll load up some rounds, go down there and, and shoot them, and uh, we'll see what we can come up with. Be also a great rifle for somebody just starting out. Got your uh, my uh, my little girl loves shooting this little thing. Um, I have no doubts that uh, you know other kids would like it too, since it is lightweight. It's fairly small. The uh, it's it's really easy to shoot. It does come with a, a dovetail rail on the top. It's where you can affix scope rings. Just make sure you get dovetail type rings. The, um, as I said, once I switched to that different magazine, it has been, it has functioned flawless. So we'll shoot a few groups here and uh, see what we can do. We'll uh, start off with a few mini mags here. But, uh, and I've shot everything from the higher end CCI and uh, even Federal Match through it all the way down to bulk pack Winchester and Federal and it's, it's been 100% so we'll see here. Okay, kind of hard to see with that little little scope, but let's uh here we'll try some of these uh, CCI standards. I really love this load in 22s. It's really consistent. Kind of hard to find, but we'll uh, we'll give these a try here. But as you see, it it functions great. Let's uh, give these a shot and see what. for doing it let's uh let's try five of the these federal gold medals here most places have these rifles on sale i mean you pick them up when they're on sale like i said for less than a hundred bucks and it's just it's just a fun little 
fun little rifle for not much money. Try one more with just some just some Winchester bolt. Twenty two prices are starting to come down. The uh, rifles themselves have always been easy to get, but now you can at least afford to shoot them again, for the most part. All right, I'll give you a close-up of the rifle here, and you can uh, check it out. Like I say, just a basic little 22. I will say, you know, the rifle is inexpensive. The, uh, the bluing on it wears. Um, you have to keep it oiled, or it will start to surface rust. But, you know, 100 bucks. I mean, what do you honestly expect? Like I said, with these 10-round mags, 100% reliable, as you can tell. The um, rifle has a little mag release right here, and it's got just a standard push button safety on the side here, just like that, as you can see. Um, I just make sure that the bolt stays lubed, and like I said, it's it's ran 100%, but um, we'll uh, walk down here real quick and just take a look at those groups and just see what happens. Nothing too extravagant, but Like I said, for a sub $100 gun, brand new in the box, it's a, it's a bargain in my book, honestly. Yeah, it's about what I expected. The, uh, uh yeah, there's a, there's that CCI standard. <laughs> That's pretty darn good. I love that load. That load shoots really good in all of the 22s that I've shot it in. Uh, here's the mini mags, a couple flyers. The uh, this was that Federal, and here is the uh, Winchester white box down there. Most definitely minute of critter. That's for sure. Which uh, I mean, this by no means is a uh, precision rig, but uh, it's most definitely. Uh, more than enough accuracy for a, a whole lot of fun. Um, as always, guys, you know what to do. If you got any questions, feel free to post them up. And uh, shoot straight. Later, fellas.